Kigali include eight district plus the under total lockdown for all 10 days. A cabinet meeting that set Wednesday, July 14, resolved to impose 10 days lockdown the city of Kigali and the eight selected district across the country from July 17th to 25th. The move has come as a result of a current increase in new cases of the COVID-19 pandemic in those areas. The 8 district plus the under total lockdown alongside with the Kigala areas are Bulela, Gichumbi, Kamoni, Musanze, Nyagatale, Lubavu, Wamagana, and also. The heavy increase of new cases has demanded a total lockdown in the city of Kigali and the other eight districts. Read statement issued by the Prime Minister officers. The citizens are urged to significantly reduce social interactions and remit movements to only essential services. It is added. During the period of total lockdown, only essential services will be allowed to operate. For example, a food markets and pharmacies will be allowed to operate at 30% capacity. All school, high education institutions will close for 10 days, with the exception for students sitting national exam who will be allowed to continue attending school for the purpose of finishing their exams. Public transport, outdoor sports, and recreational activities will not be permitted in the effect of those areas. Air transport and tourism related activity will continue under strict COVID-19 guidelines. Elsewhere in the country, movement are prohibited between 6 p.m. to 4 a.m. and business will be closed at 5 p.m. Inter-district travel continues to be suspended except for essential services. Social gathering like wedding are suspended but funeral are allowed with attendees not exceeding 10 and 15 persons respectively. All allowed in those areas are churches who have been permitted to operate in the first two weeks of July, Rwanda recorded almost 10,761 10, COVID-19 cases and almost 160-rated facilities, and many also have lost the life, having different COVID-19 waves, mostly in takes away the business life and people are now yeah, have a hope to regain their economy, to restrain their economy. This is all a third total lockdown that is going to be conducted in Rwanda, hopefully encouraging everybody to take the measure and use the laws and the regulation to have all it takes to protect our life through